Hey everybody, how you doing? All right, so uh, we have an update uh, to share regarding the scale uh, V2 release update. So um, I, I'm just gonna start, I, I can't even hold this back. We have some exciting news. Um, uh, Stan, do you wanna, wanna give, give people the update? Yeah, basically uh, all of our bugs have been fixed. So we are proceeding with uh, actually deploying the update to the main net, to the DAP net. All of these things are happening as we speak now. We actually need to update many things. We need to update our contracts. Some of this already has started. Then we need to, to go to each validator and update every node or the software on each node. We need also to update some of, of the additional infrastructure we're running, such as proxies and some networking things. So it's, it is quite a big thing, having that we already have chains running and they have to be continuing to run. But it's very exciting, I think, because with this V2, we pretty much have everything that people uh, asked us for to run uh, successful DApps. We're going to have Dips. We're gonna have uh, hubs where people will be able to exchange their NFTs and tokens into into stable currencies, so real money. So we have the entire system of people playing games, people using DeFi, and then some of them actually taking their profits. So I'm super excited about that. Yeah, and and you know I think people will be really pleased to see that we're actually gonna beat. The projected timeline. I, I uh, yesterday I was saying, or a couple of days ago, I was saying we're looking at next week on the 19th. But Chadwick, why don't you uh, why don't you share the details here? Yeah, let me get into it and share the current roadmap and how we're tracking. So today is April 14th. That's highlighted here. Um, we are currently, as we speak, upgrading the staging network where a lot of customers are um, already working on a lot of the V2 features. We're upgrading that with the latest hotfix. Um, yesterday, we updated the, in regards to testnet, this is the staging ground for validators to test the upgrade process. Uh, we upgraded the foundation nodes that are operating on testnet. Uh, the external validators are finishing their upgrades as we speak. Um, and then between now and throughout the weekend, we'll be doing the final, observing the final proving, running tests nonstop. And as of today, we're also preparing the upgrade scripts for skill manager and IMA. And so we'll be upgrading that um, either today or tomorrow and submitting those upgrade transactions. And then after the weekend on Monday, we're gonna have a final internal go, no go decision. Um, you're just looking at all the testing results that have occurred over the weekend. And then validators will begin performing their upgrades on Monday. Um, and then as soon as the validators push out their, their upgrades, which will be very quick, uh, we'll be able to then deploy uh, V2 uh, scale chains on mainnet. So. A lot of things are happening. We'll be working over the weekend just to set up the final proving ground and stages. And as of today, we're performing the upgrade scripts for mainnet skill manager and IMA contracts. So we beat the timelines by just a bit. Um, and then we're working around the clock just to make this happen and get the final rollouts in place. Awesome, thanks Chadwick. So what, what this means is uh, tomorrow, contracts start getting upgraded, okay? and. And hey, I, I just wanna say thanks. Uh, we wouldn't have been able to do this. There's uh, people from over 50 different organizations and you know, 100 people plus that have been involved in, in this upgrade from many, many different companies. Um, and so, hey, thank you, Scale Community. Thanks for everybody who participated. And you know, we're, we're just pumped for the next stage. So um, next week, there'll be an update with regards to more information around Scale Hubs and what the rollout plan is going to be. Um, there'll, there will be uh, precision and strategy around how uh, the chains go live because of a dynamic around token bridging. And what we want to do is make sure that while we have all of these chains, that scale is optimized from a user experience perspective. Okay, So um, a lot of that gets into token mapping and standards. And the goal is to take all that complexity, let it live behind the scenes and make it incredibly easy for users to use applications across the entire scale verse. So um, you'll see some uh, some blog posts next week digging into that rollout plan, 
and uh, and token mapping and scale hubs. And uh, so um, excited to share more details. Um, all right, everybody, thanks for listening. Um, let's keep it going. All right, thanks. Bye, guys. Bye.